Oh, uh, the Wii. You know you've designed a good system and controller when it comes with instructions, a health and safety warning, a pictogram of a TV being broken, and a physical restraint mechanism before the start of every game. <laughs> Feels like the fires of hell strapped around my wrist. What can I say from smashing TVs to accidentally bonking your loved ones on the head? 2006 was a year of carnage. Get out of my way, baby. I don't have time for kittens right now. Screw you, Samsung. Kneel before the power of the Wii Wiimote. Don't get me wrong, inclusivity in gaming is so important, and I love that the Wii brought more people into the world of games. But I thought we'd moved on from pure motion controls until Nintendo went ahead and announced the return of the Wii Sports series with the upcoming Switch Sports game. I was originally going to make a video about the Switch Sports playtest, but Nintendo had this weird NDA and believe it or not, I'm a good boy. So instead I thought I'd take a trip down memory lane and play some Wii Sports instead. But first, we gotta make ourselves a me. Quickly everyone, to the me plaza. Okay, so the vibe I'm going for is a me from 2006 that has aged and was forgotten about, but is just so happy to see you after all these years and come out of me retirement. Don't forget to check in on your me's people. They miss you. That thought just made me realize that for a lot of people, when their we's inevitably break, their me's will die with them. Everyone, a moment's silence for all the me's that have been lost along the way. I'm pretty happy with this. Uh, I'll add some yellow to brighten up our days and nice, it's looking good. So everyone, meet Strudel. I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna close my eyes and see what we land on. And baseball it is. Oh gosh, here we go, motion controls. <laughs> of course, straight through the body. This feels like a comfortable technique. If I keep my eye on both the ball and the bat, nothing can stand in my way. Baseball isn't very big where I'm from, so I don't know much about it, but I'm gonna go ahead and assume that baseball players don't do this before every game. And if not, what the hell are they doing? Oh, I haven't had to stand up and play a game in a very long time. I forgot that I had legs. I feel so alive. Here. Oh no, boo. That was such a weak hit. I need to work on my little noodle arms. And, oh no, it's straight at the fielder. Wait, whoa. <laughs> That fourth wall breaking stare is harrowing. Do we know each other? Have I, have I wronged this me in a past life? What is going on? I don't feel safe anymore. Nowhere is safe. What was that? What was that noise? Who's there? At least not wanting to experience any more creepy stares is a good incentive to not lose. Oh no, gosh, just as I say that, here it comes. Look away, everyone. Oh god, my soul has been tainted. I'm crushing it at pitching though, and I swear my team looks way less threatening when we get them out. The question is, can we get a home run? Or probably a better question, can anyone actually score in this game at all? Maybe if I visualized the maze that gave me death stairs as the ball, I'll hit it better. Oh snap, this is looking good. It's going all the way. Haha, <laughs> yes, it worked. That's right, learn how to blink, you perfectly adequate members of me society. It must be so awkward being a fielder in real baseball and having to watch everyone run around on a home run. It's gotta stand there and think about how much a team sucks. That's rough. <laughs> what is going on with that pitcher though? They're sweating up a storm right now. Should we go? Cool? Do we need to call off the match? They're, they're gonna die of dehydration at this rate. Ooh, wait, what? What is happening? Hold the phone, I think. My, yep, I don't think my controller is working. It is not responding. Maybe the batteries are dying or something? I don't even know if I have any batteries. <laughs> okay, so I haven't moved the controller this entire time and I'm doing better at pitching than when I was actually playing the game. The game's just bugging out and playing itself at this point. I still won though. Oh, weird, it says the controller still does have batteries, so I'll just resync it and see if that works. Okay, hopefully the controller's fixed because it's boxing time. Ah uh, no, the battery's definitely dying. I can only block with the nunchuck. I'm just gonna have to go full left hand. Fighting with only one hand was a mistake. Ryan, stop. This is meant to be an exhibition match. I'm generally not a violent person, but I'd appreciate it if you kept letting me hit you in the face. Ah, uh, this sucks. I'm gonna go find some batteries. Also, I say batteries when it's batteries. I don't even speak English properly. 
Hey, hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to move batteries from a TV remote into your Wii remote. First you want to take your chopsticks and remove the batteries. Oh, there we go, this is so much better. Get freaking thwomped! How do you like boxing me now that I have two hands, Ryan? How do you like being punched in the face, Ryan? What are you thinking about now that you're unconscious, Ryan? Oh, Ryan, I hate the way you get up after you've been knocked out. A lot of pelvis, not a lot of head. I'm sorry, Ryan, but the time has come for me to end you. Just go to sleep, Ryan. Just go to sleep. Yay, boxing! We both broke parts of each other's bodies! All right, all right, all right, it's bowling time. But I must warn you. <laughs> I may just be the greatest wee bowling player that has ever lived. Um, please let go of the ball. I'm, st I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. Oh, we're grinding on the gutter like Tony Hawk. I think it's, I think it's actually gonna curve back though. It is. This is amazing. <laughs> wow, that was the coolest, slowest thing I've ever done. Okay, this is the one. Oh no! Sorry, everyone. Is everybody okay? Oh, look at that line. This is nice. <laughs> what the hell was that? Whatever just happened is unacceptable. Okay, I'm not gonna get my hoops up. I'm just gonna throw it. Not expecting anything. Doesn't have to be a strike, it's fine. Whatever comes my way. Oh my God, am I cursed? That one pin. Oh, it's so slow. <laughs> you can do it, buddy. You, you got this ball. You can, you can roll down there. Well, it doesn't look like I'm gonna get a single strike, but at least I'm starting to get some spare. <laughs> Let's move on from bowling, shall we? <laughs> Look, Wii Tennis, that's cool. Anyway, so, wait, what? You, you want me to play Wii Tennis? <laughs> well, well I did and I only, I only won, I only won one point and it really sucked and I'm kind of embarrassed about it. Look, the only good thing to come out of playing Wii Tennis was getting to listen to the announcer's voice. The Wii Sports guy is just so positive. I wonder who did the voice acting for the Wii Sports game. Nintendo.fandom.com says that Josh Millman was the voice of the Wii Sports announcer. Bless your heart, Josh. You got us all through some rough times. Okay, it also says that Josh Millman is an American audio engineer and a voice actor based in Portland, Oregon. He is the announcer of Wii Sports and Wii Sports Resort. He was replaced by an unknown individual for Wii Sports Club. Um, excuse me? They replaced Josh Millman, THE Josh Millman, and we don't even know who the voice of Wii Sports Club is? How is this, how is this possible? The people want answers, Nintendo. I want answers. Anyway, so that was, that was Wii Tennis. <laughs> now it's golf time. Oh, Wii Golf. It's all coming back to me. That sea breeze, the green, green grass and the red floppy noodle power bar that haunts me to this very day. Okay, let's just take the first shot nice and easy. Ah, oh, no. Damn old dente linguine flopping all over the place. A little tappy tap. No need to hurt the ball. We like the ball. Ball is our friend. Oh yes, that was good. Ah, oh, but I forgot about the wind. <sighs> Button time. Got a hit and hope. Ooh, the linguine is so straight when you use the putter. And... Bogey. Hey, that's pretty good. Wow, that's easily the best shot I've done so far. Wait, what the heck was that bounce? Oh, mm. the power gauge is awful in the bunker. Oh, but maybe I can use the red linguini to my advantage. If I aim it a bit to the side, the flaccid power bar will either flop the right way and it would be really good or it will flop the other way and be horrific. Let's go left. Left feels good. Uh, and now I'm doubting myself. Okay, let's go right instead. Oh, come on. I trusted you with my life, Linguini. Well, we've all learned a valuable lesson today. Never place your trust in a flaccid Linguini. And that terrible bunker shot concludes our trip down Wii Sports memory lane. I feel like mini games and party games usually age okay, and I enjoyed playing Wii Sports after all these years. It's still nothing compared to the Pokemon Stadium Kids Club games though. I'd love to hear your thoughts and Wii Sports experiences, along with your opinions on the upcoming Switch Sports in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching and remember to hit the like and subscribe buttons. And why not go and check in on your old me's? Make sure they're doing okay. They miss you. Thanks everyone. Have a great week. You know you
want to throw me at the TV. It would be so easy. If you don't, I'll tell everyone you were more of a PS3 fanboy in 2006. <laughs>